Tom, police say 54 year old Kimberly Heller's mother died back in May, but they didn't find her body until October. Now throughout that time period, police say social security payments continued to be deposited in her account. Kimberly Heller, aged 54, was arrested on November 18th, 2021 and charged with abuse of a corpse by the Bedford Police Department. Police first responded to Heller's home on October 24th after her family requested a welfare check for her mother, whom they had not seen for several months. However, no one was home the day that they visited. When officers returned the next day, police say Heller refused to let them inside. Police returned with a search warrant and discovered her mother's dead body. An autopsy later determined that Heller's mother had died of natural causes just days before Memorial Day in May. Investigators also learned that during the nearly six months that Heller hid her mother's corpse, her mother's social security payments were still being deposited into the bank. Police said that they alerted the Federal Social Security Administration office and are coordinating with the agency's investigation. It is unclear how much money in social security checks Heller is alleged to have pocketed, but Heller was expected to be arraigned on January 6, 2022. This, however, is not the only recent case of family members keeping their dead parents' body at home for months. In September, an Australian man was arrested for mummifying his mother and keeping her body preserved in the basement via an assortment of ice packs and bandages. The local authorities alleged that the man, who was 66 years old, continued to collect his 89-year-old mother's pension and welfare benefits for more than a year. It's crazy times that we live in where people are willing to keep a dead corpse inside of their home for a paycheck. Let me know what you guys think about this story in the comment section. Thank you for tuning in.